Long before Spike Lee, John Singleton, and Julie Dash broke barriers for black cinema, Oscar Micheaux became the first major black filmmaker to produce and direct his own films. Ever the entrepreneur, Oscar Micheaux left home at 16, became a train porter, and then a homesteader. Supporting a farm was anything but easy. Michaud turned to writing as a new source of income. And in 1917, Michaud would publish a book that altered his future forever. It was called The Homesteader, and he adapted it into a silent movie, which he produced independently. The Homesteader began Michaud's career as the first major independent producer-director of black films. His work critiqued the racist stereotypes of black people, typically depicted in Hollywood films. You are seeing a whole range of black characters on the screen, assertive, articulate, often sophisticated, strong characters who are trying to do something for themselves and the community. His fifth film, Within Our Gates, directly rebutted the blatant racism of D.W. Griffith's Birth of a Nation, a three-hour-long piece of Jim Crow-era propaganda. Within Our Gates responds directly to Birth of a Nation. The negative, stereotypical portraits of black people that were shown there were not how black people really were. And then, showing that white supremacy was really the main problem in the South. Other films, like The Symbol of the Unconquered and Body and Soul, sought to entertain while also delivering social commentary. He covered issues that were not being covered in film, generally speaking. Lynching, discrimination, struggles around employment, class differences amongst African Americans. Censor boards often edited Michaud's movies or rejected them outright. He used these attempts to censor his work to his advantage, marketing uncensored versions to curious and daring audiences. Forced to fund his own work, Michaud's success was self-made. Over a career spanning more than three decades, Michaud created more than 35 films and is considered the most influential African-American filmmaker of his time.